Welcome back, trainers. I am out here in one of my favorite spots to get away with Athena, secret location. It's not too far away from my house, yet there is never anybody here. And we've got all the spaces over here. So folks, I hear you, you're talking about the remote raid pass. <laughs> if you heard me on the stream, I already gave my opinion. I was just a straight up Frank version. But let's talk about, let's talk about what's going on here and you know, you're not gonna see any Pokemon Go gameplay. And if it's wobbly, forgive me. I'll try to keep it as steady as I can, but I uh, can't promise anything. This is just the adventure mode. We have some pretty crazy, look. See that trail behind me? I'm gonna go up that trail. We got a beautiful scenery. <laughs> so when, we, when I get there, we'll take a look, we'll talk some more. And uh, we'll talk about the remote raid pass and, and how doing too much extra is going to, in the future, make it seem like you're gonna to have to continue to do that. And if you don't keep up with that extra that you've been doing, just because, like we've been discussing, repercussions happen, we'll talk about it. Let's go up that trail, see what we got going on for that view over there. talk about so that sun is really bright the remote ray pass and what they're doing here now it's right in my eyes uh, if it's a little windy forgive me it is gonna be like that hopefully the wind guard on my mic is uh, working so they took away the remote raid pass that was one poker coin in the thing and they replaced it with three super incubators which is obviously a lot better as far in terms of value simple as that it's just simple it's just better um, don't see if they're why they're trying to kill remote rating. Are they trying to slow it down? I guess that could be called killing it. Yeah, so maybe they're trying to do that. But look, folks, they stated a long time ago that this is a, this you know things were going to change. You know they were bringing in changes because of what had happened several years ago, and things are kind of going back to normality. I hope where you live. So they're bringing the game back to normality. And then they raise the price in the uh, remote bundles. They're never gonna take them out. They're always gonna be here. Remote rating's always gonna be here, <laughs> right? So don't have to worry about that. But as far as them increasing the price by 50 Poke coins for the three, I mean, I feel like sometimes people get more upset on purpose, like they, they, you know, they try to make themselves get really upset, and then when you speak out and make it seem like it's not a big deal, then they make it seem like you're the really big, big bad guy. Look, this is look it. Look, let me show you where I'm at. All right, look, I, <laughs> I do this every day, and if you keep worrying about this stuff, you get one life, okay? You get one life. Don't put out so much negative energy, and I, I know I'm one to say that, but I put out tough love, all right? And if you mess with the freaking badger, you're gonna get scratched, all right? That's pretty much me. That's it, simple. So don't worry about all this stuff so much, folks. <laughs> they raise the price. They're never gonna remove them, and that's pretty much it. Did you want me to say, Niantic's the worst? Niantic, what are you doing? You are money hungry and this and that. We already know this. I'm trying to give you some advice. Better to do this than to rant and just go on about Niantic. We know this. We know Niantic's this and Niantic's that. We know that, okay? So enjoy your life, folks. Yeah, there's things that I complain about, like, you know, straight up broken Go Battle League. I don't tweet about it as much. It happens every day, but I'm not tweeting about it because I know it becomes old. And we already know. It's like, okay, Grandpa. You know, <laughs> we already all know that it is broken. So 
constantly staying in, and I will do it once in a while, but not every day. As far as the increased price, look, I, I think they're gonna even increase it higher. So get ready for inflation in Pokemon Go as well. So, and what will I think about that? Again, I don't have really much to say. I don't know that, that it's Niantic's move. I'm just a content creator. And of, out of all the content creators, I am the most slept on out of all of them. You all know this already. So it's not like, look, I feel like my voice does make an impact. It's stolen and then just, you know, no, no credit, no nothing like that. It's just done. That's it. That's me. So, yeah, I don't know what to tell you as far as uh, the remote rate passes. It's just going to happen like that. And, you know, if you go to a job and you do extra things and you stop doing it after a month and people look at you like, what's your problem? Like, why are you being so lazy? Right? When you were doing so much extra that you were, then that's kind of like what Niantic is doing. They were doing extra. And it was to keep the, the, the game alive. Because could you imagine if they didn't introduce the remote rates? And you better believe they had those ready already. Remote raids were ready to go. They just were like, okay, and it's time to go. And that was right about now. And they pushed the button and they activated it. All right. So it's not like they just sprung up because of that. And now they're like, oh, well, the, the, the thing is gone. Nobody's, you know, everything seems back to normal. We're just going to remove raid passes, the, the remote ones. That's not going to happen. So there's always going to be here. I don't know. That's a little bit of a... It's not too much of a price change. So anyways, I don't know, folks. That's pretty much it. Just wanted to talk to you really quick and go for a walk. I was wanting to do this as a live stream, but I thought it'd be a little bit better to do it as a video because what's going to happen is, uh, you know, it's going to get all cut out like last time and all choppy. You're not going to even be able to understand what I'm saying. Hopefully this wind isn't going crazy. But uh, Athena's having a good time. You having a good time, girl? Come say hello to everybody. Yeah, she said hello. Yeah. Waggy tail, happy girl. Yeah. I just took her, woke her up from her nap. I was like, let's go for another walk. She's like, what? Absolutely. Okay, so, yeah, this is like a, I don't know, a dumping ground for concrete. These are like two chimneys or something here. And uh, sometimes I like to just come and play Pokemon Go in areas like this. Look, I like to just chill by myself, you know? It's just nice, quiet. I don't have to worry about anything. All right, folks, thank you for watching. Take a look at that. Looks like we're going to get some rain. We could use a little bit of rain. All right, take care, trainers.